Alright guys, wir sind gerade da. Nächstlich. Der Draft and Sonoki would be really cool. I mean, like Chris, he was already like Chris is already already 1600. Like that's insane. Already being 1600, insane. <laughs> yeah, Chris is a bit different, but he's, to be fair, he's also streaming like 12 hours a day. I don't get how he's streaming 12 hours a day now. <laughs> I could never do that. Even, even though I was streaming 24 hours in the Sabaton, it was like a special event. But he's just doing it like occasionally. As what is your opinion on the shiny spear, by the way? Uh, no, I feel like the shiny spear is so like it looks cool, but it's like it doesn't really do much. This is my opinion. Alright, already level 6, we are Skrada, really good, really good. I'm from EU. He is a full time gamer, yeah. I mean, like, it's his job, right? But you need to, like, imagine, like, normally you just, like, play 8 hours a day, maybe, right? But he's also editing his own videos, so, like. He's editing his own videos, but he's also streaming, like, 12 hours a day. It's like. Oh. To be fair, I, like, I could maybe do that as well if I would be fully focused on content creation, but since I'm a competitive player, I'm also going to London in April to represent you. I also have like team practice, right? But it's still like this state of the game, playing like, solo queue for 12 hours is so crazy to me. Like, I generally don't enjoy solo queue. Like, yesterday was the best solo queue day. I generally had no fun. Oh my god, muscle band with Razor Leaf is actually insane. Like the muscle band changes where like every auto attack counts as a, as a muscle band hit. The Razor Leaf is insane now. He did so much damage. It's not about the question about Chris Heroes can be a competitive player or not. He is a competitive player. Even if he is not playing competitively, he is a competitive player. He used to be a professional for 10 years, right? Like, it's not about the question if he can or cannot. He can be a competitive player for sure in this, in, you know, it, he has the skill and he has the knowledge. But he wants to be a content creator, right? Can you play some Greedon? I could play Greedon next game, maybe. If you want to request a Pokemon, um, you can also um, get the membership. If you are um, like tier 1 sub, like get to fan, then you can request a Pokemon with a bait. And if you are tier 3, you can have also a coaching session with me. In the future, like not in the future, in the upcoming days, we're gonna upload a video because I was doing live coaching on YouTube, I mean on Twitch, yesterday with my tier 3 uh, sub, right? That was pretty fun. Get some live coaching. I always try to use my Unite move when my passive props. Because when my passive props and I use Unite move, I have 20% more lifesteal. Meaning I, even though 
it seems like I'm gonna get one shotted. I will not get one shotted because I'm only uh, um, half HP, right? I get like a lot of life steal. Bye, have a great time. Okay, the great escape. <sighs> How many good items set for Buzzwall or Fencer? I mean, for Buzzwall, you could play like 6 white and 6 brown. You don't really need the 7 black emblems. I'm not sure if I can do anything, but maybe. So much damage! It's such a shot amount of time. As a competitive like thinking, it's pretty old. Like even though like I am 22, right? I'm not like the oldest in the competitive scene, but like, when you are 18 or like 17, you're actually like pretty young, right? I mean I guess like 22 is fine, but there's a lot of young talent. Like, this is a really good Mirskalata game. It's probably like one with K damage game. Just after double defenders. But no, Super is an anime. I don't think if you can get it, but maybe. I've got some. Almost. Like, usually, I don't recommend you to use Ultimate at, at 250, but it's fine because I can farm my unit move. The city is probably gonna rip it all. Nice. I'm gonna try to stop them from scoring. Actually, I can score. If we stop two shields, we win the game. The second score for free. Nice. One Pikachu. I don't think we can stop the Blaster Shield. If we can still win the game, we just need to stop them from, from scoring more points. If we kill the Blasters, it's insane. Luckily, we have a good show. We can probably kill the Blasters and the push it. Let's push top lane and if we kill them, we win the game. I'm not sure if we can kill the good in time, but I can just score honestly. Let's keep scoring small points and we are fine. You just let's got hundred points, we're only struggling, so we won. Really cool that uh, my team is not giving up when they lost the Rayquaza. Thinking about how they can win and then they just catch the Blastoise. As if the Blastoise would have survived, it would have been a really hard game. But yeah, this is how I play Night Slash 12 days. I didn't really talk much, but just scoring small points and then winning the game with the score. More points. 
20 kills, we are now 123 damage. Hope you guys enjoyed the gameplay. Thank you for watching, guys, and I will see you guys in the next video.